Hey buds, welcome back to Madables and welcome back to... I just, I, I blinked, I, I got distracted because my, my Christmas tree is still here. I haven't got my Christmas tree right next to the Master Sword, respectively. Let's get into it. Hi, how's it going? Check out this thing, greatly appreciate it. Uh, I got, not a new microphone, but I, I got attachments. I got, I got like this fluffy thing. It's supposed to be a pop filter. I got a new cable. Uh, I got a new mic arm. And I was hoping it would increase the quality of my microphone. So I guess, uh... I guess we'll see. I don't know. I haven't listened to myself in like in it with it yet, so it's gonna be uh, interesting. Uh, also, I don't know if it's allergies. My my throat's uh, it's not great today, so we're gonna we're gonna keep it on a on a more chill level. I guess we're going. It's not quite ASMR, but we're uh, we're gonna be vibing today. So all my reactions this week are gonna be uh, they're gonna be they're gonna be down like a point or two. All right. Anyway, this is uh, episode thirty nine. The following is a non-profit fan-based parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toy Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. That's that supposed to be Chi-Chi and Gohan. <laughs> 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 so does this mean they're on our side? <laughs> I never know when that thing comes up. Also, you guys still enjoying the series? I don't know if I did a I did a check-in on JoJo. I don't remember if I did a check-in on this. I just like to, you know, jump in from time to time and be like, hey, are you guys still enjoying like the series? Um, do you want to see more of it? Do you want me to switch to something else? You know, because it's always hard when you're doing like a whole series reaction. You don't know like, do I do people want to see the whole show and stuff? Like, did they only want to see a few chapters or up until a certain point? I have no idea. So, check in. Are you enjoying it so far? You want to see it till the end? Because I will if you will. Well, that's all that. You're definitely Vegeta's kid. So, you are done throwing a hissy fit? At least I did something instead of just standing there staring at them. We do do that a lot. What? Yeah. They're still alive? Yeah, they do. But that was my strongest blast. So you just assumed they were destroyed then? We do that a lot too! Besides, <laughs> what exactly changed from you in the future and now? Okay, alright, real, real quick, real quick. It's like every every episode as we get into this, uh, I, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm liking other characters. Like, Krillin, Krillin's coming in, dude. Krillin, I, I really enjoy Krillin in the in this series. Like, the last few episodes, I'm like, I love Vegeta. Alright, Vegeta's great. I also have respect for Trunks for being a well-designed character. But like... Krillin, I never expected to be, like, that comic relief. Uh, I think in the, of the original show, he was, like, a, a lighter version of that. But this, like, chef's kiss. I love what they did with him. More than I thought, less than you'd think. Man, mystery kid up there sure is cranky. I think someone needs a nap. Whatever. Let's just pop this bad boy open. Initializing update one of 1,430... Yeah, screw that. Man, you it's are a Napa. tall bastard. So, Fire Crotch, what's your name? I am designated as Android 16. What are the odds? The old man did always have a one-track mind. What's your deal? I am programmed with the sole purpose of murdering Son Goku. See, this is what oh. I'm talking about. I'm glad I killed him. You killed Son Goku? No, Dr. Jiro. Oh. May we go and murder Son Goku? Well, ain't got nothing better to do. So if the name of the game is Kill Son Goku. Let's play. Just leave him alone, all right? You, can't, you killed your master, you can go anywhere in the universe. Like, if I was them, I mean, I guess they have that kind of opinion anyway. Because, like, if I was them, I'd go want to go to a new planet and do whatever I want to do without anyone, without any kind of power level, you know? Go to the weakest planet possible, just have a little bit of fun. You know, but I guess they, I guess they want, I want the, they want the adrenaline. They want to, they want to kill the power, you know? Or absorb it. Can they absorb? I think it was just the master that did hey, that, right? 
We should grab us a car. The hell do we need a car? Because I want one. Uh, are they flying away? Get back here! I am sick and tired of being ignored! I wish we could ignore you. No, Dad, stop! Are we really doing this again? I wish you'd understand. There's no way we can fight them without Goku! And I wish you'd understand who you're talking to! I am Vegeta! Well, Alright. Alright. Question. Is Goku really the only one that can kill them? Because Trunks is supposedly pretty strong now, and, like, I guess Vita died back then too, so it's really only Trunks is the difference. Goku was dead. Right? Yeah, Goku, Goku was dead. So I guess just the addition of Trunks, I guess he was just coming back here to tell people to not kill Goku. So then Goku could kill them? What if he messed up on the time thing? What if he teleported, like, right after Goku died? What, what are you gonna do then? Make it wait until you, I guess, another 20 years and then do it all again? Why would I ever need that gibbering fool's help? Because you're not as strong as- <laughs> You pushed the Goku button! You shouldn't have did that! Okay. Uh, Chi Chi! You might want to come in! It, it was Goku in the intro, not, uh, not go on. In here! Sorry, hun! Cooking up a storm in here! This is looking kind of bad! He's screaming up a lot of blood! I'll make sure there's plenty of iron and protein in the meal! And I can't really remember the last time he inhaled! And while that's sort of impressive, I don't think it's healthy. Goku doesn't have a ton of brain cells to work with as it is. Look, to be honest, it's just nice to have him in the house for a change. Random thing. Do you think that Goku just did that whole thing in one take? Do you think he just screamed for like a minute and a half straight? Because be, that would be impressive, you know? But they could have totally edited like a few of them together, like aimlessly, seamlessly is the word. Um, but if you did it in one scream, which you technically can do, very impressive. I enjoyed that. Oh good, he took a <laughs> Children on airplanes, am I right? Alright, here's my idea. First car that comes our way, we appropriate it. Ugh, and all the way out here in the boonies, it's probably gonna be a semi. <gasps> oh, I hope it's a truck. What do you think, Sixteen? Will it assist us in murdering Son Goku? I don't know, I guess you could hit him pretty hard with it. Then I too hope it is a truck. Well, well, well. If it isn't Faggity Andy and on the Raggedy Ann. I'm going to break his arm. Kind of proven his point, ain't you, sis? Shut up, Ann. So, which of you children wants to tangle with the Saiyan Elite? Eh, I don't know. How about you, Sixteen? No. He is not Goku. Man, we need to get you a hobby. Acquiring hobby. Bird watching. Mm. Well then, Eighteen, guess he's all yours. Is that really? Did it, is there any other reason he scanned that bird? Does he just enjoy birds? That'd be so cute. That'd be so cute if he just liked birds. Um, I'm actually really excited for the episode where, like, Android 18, I, I always get them confused, um, loves Krillin. You know? Like, what, like what, what changes the Android's, like, mental state to, like, be like, I can love now, you know? I'm on car watching duty. Ah, oh, thanks. Make me fight the troll doll. So, ladies first, then. Well, just to warn you, I'm not afraid to hit a woman. That's fine. Neither am I. Have gone. Hey, so was Vegeta always blonde, or...? The birds flew away. Oh, yeah? I like the birds. Yeah. Good for you, man. Oh, I love that ah, for him. First blood! You may as well give up now and- God damn it, I was kidding! <laughs> yeah, this is a good episode, man. This is totally solid. This- I've been telling you this could have aired on TV and I would have- I would have thought it was the same thing, man. This is great. Huh? What is it, Clem? Oh, truck. Well, you ain't gonna believe this. A couple of Europeans are fighting on top of the truck? Huh. That is weird. You know what else is weird? Aw, oh, <laughs> damn it, Mitch! Put that away! I can't believe he's taking them on alone! He has no idea the kind of destructive force they pack! 
The androids are humanity's greatest threat. <laughs> I will kill as many people as I have to as long as you are one of them. That's funny. That's funny. That's a, that's a good scene. Because I was like, did this many people die in this fight? Like, I was just thinking about it, because I'm like, that guy exploded, this guy ran into a wall, you punch it through this guy's cards. He's like, <laughs> yeah, I will kill as many people as I have to, as long as you're one of them, is the most Vegeta thing I've ever heard in my life. Oh, hey, team, you're back. No cars yet. I need to get that, like, on a shirt or, like, a poster. I think that would do perfect right here. I have to remember this. Oh, please hope I remember this. You know, there is a freeway over there, right? Oh, I know. This is just funner. So, Android, are you done running? I don't know. Is your mouth? Well, aren't you f***ing clever? But wait! I have a retort! Ah, oh, yeah! A truck! Ah, oh, dick! Be honest, is this just a short guy thing? You talk a lot of shit for a washing machine. And no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, oh my god. This is so good. Oh my god, I, can, the ne I hope the next few episodes are just like this. Oh my god. This is so funny. It's so funny. Don't make me laugh. My throat hurts. Okay. Oh, dick. Be honest. Is this just a short guy thing? You talk a lot of shit for a washing machine. And no, I'm not just saying that because you're an android. I'm saying it because you're a ah! Ah! Mm. You know what? Just for that, I'm not gonna take it easy on you anymore! God, hold on. I know. I'm sorry. Pause. I feel, maybe I'm pausing more than usual. That that violin was cinematic. Almost. You never hear that kind of thing, like casually. You know. You know what? Just for that, I'm not gonna take it easy on you anymore. Beautiful. Hmm. Father, are you in there? Did anyone get the number of that bitch? 18. <laughs> Thank you. You okay in there, Vegeta? Eat a dick. Oh, okay, he's fine. Oh, hey, Vegeta's little pal showed up. Get rid of random question. What's their power level in, in consideration to sell? You know, I'm kind of just interested in seeing how the power, like, aggressives, because, like, we always talk about how, like, the power scaling in the show is kind of nuts. Uh, but it's just interesting because, like, they always bump into like the next the next group of people is like really strong. That's like okay, we beat them. Next next group of people really strong, and you you kind of double down. So like, what are what are their consideration to the next one? And I guess is Cell weaker than Boo? Like is always the previous villain weaker than the one coming up? It kind of has to be, right? I I love the idea of Boo. I just don't remember anything about Boo really. That's where I kind of like. Well, because I watched it when it was, like, releasing on television, so, like, if you didn't watch it when it came out, you didn't have an option for it, you know? So I, I missed a bunch of Boo episodes. How about it, 16? Wanna go knock some heads? No. Whatever, man. Father! Oh, oh thank God you're still alive! We have to get out of here now! Are you kidding me? I have her right where I want her! Do you live in your own little world? Yes, but unfortunately, I have to share it with all of you. Actually, <laughs> Vegeta, you don't have to share it all. You two seem like you're having fun, so I'd hate to have to interrupt. But if any of you decide to jump in and help MC Widow's Peak over there, I will personally introduce you to the ground. And trust me, your relationship will be intimate. Yeah, not exactly in a rush to help out Vegeta. I mean, maybe if it were Goku. Did he say Goku? Calm down, 16. He's not here. But I heard him mention Goku. Just focus on your birds, buddy. Acquiring birds. He likes birds now. Can we stop talking about Kakarot for just a minute? I mean, for God's sakes, he's never even around! Sad thing is, he's not exactly wrong. 
Now, if you'd like to continue this fight, I can finally get around to disassembling you, you smug c**t. Oh. <sighs> yep. Let's see how you handle this! She handled it. Does that ruffle you, Android? Well, you've managed to destroy my favorite slash only jacket and ruin my leggings. So yeah, ruffled's a good word. Well, that was only a taste of my power. Now experience my Super Saiyan Damn. How? It's also nuts how, like, Goku is the only one that can keep up with these guys. Like, because Vegeta, I, I, I feel like they're not far off. You know, if you're Super Saiyan 1, I feel like you're on this, a similar level, right? Actually, that's another good question. Is Super Saiyan 1 the same for everybody? Is it like a, like, let's just say, ten, like, let's just say 10,000. In order to get to Super Saiyan level 1, it's like 10,000. And is everybody at that same power level? Or is everybody Super Saiyan, like Goku's is like 20,000, Vegeta's is 500, you know? Or is it like that? That's your frame of power level, and then when you hit over that, then you're Super Saiyan two. Or is Goku just like, like it's, it's, it just baffles me that Goku is the only one. I figured Vegeta was like, maybe a little bit more. He's he he can only what the, what the hell was that? He can only rip leggings, you know. How quickly bravado goes out the window when you're flat on your ass. That's pretty sad. <laughs> sad for you. I love the cutoffs, they're so good at that. 49, 50, 51, 52, 50. Damn, so close to a new record. How's he doing in there? He's doing fine. He's doing fine. Oh wow, it's a longer one. Four, five, six. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent episode. Absolutely loved it. Oh my god. I I hope. I hope it retains this kind of quality throughout the rest of the, the season and stuff. Or even just the rest of the show. God, that was great. Thank you guys for being here. I appreciate it. Um, let me know in the questions. Otherwise, I hope you're enjoying the show and the series as much as I am. Subscribe to Mattables for more reaction content. See you.